me bring in my panel radio host, Ralphie Aversa. Turf or the player, Ralphie? Definitely the turf. And we thought some of these Republican presidential candidates were on shaky ground for crying oh! out loud. This is a brand Whoa. new stadium. <laughs> I mean, and the fact that, as Tom mentioned, the Super Bowl is going to be held here. This field, by the way, has been replaced multiple times since the summer. What are they going to do come February when they're hosting the biggest game of the year there? We'll have to wait and find out. I know. Like, that is the biggest concern of all. The Super Bowl is in February. That's only a few months away. Ralphie, what are your four words to live by? Always remember the snacks. I'm really hungry right now. I'm sorry. <laughs> Ralphie, do you think that Urban Meyer should listen to fans and give Barrett more playing time? No, I, I think that you got to stick with the guy that brought you to the national championship and brought the national championship home last year, and that was Jones. I mean, obviously, it's a great problem for Urban to have, and I don't know what deal he made with the devil. For crying out loud, last year, he <laughs> takes a third-string quarterback and brings him all the way to the national championship, and now this year, I mean, he's got a quarterback controversy, but both of these QBs, either of them, could start at any D1 school in the country. So it's a good problem for Urban to have, but I think you stick with Jones. Ralphie, what about for you? It's, it's on the index twice today. Do we just really need more motivation? motivation today than other Mondays? Apparently, either more motivation and or more caffeine. I'm not really sure which one it is, to be honest, Melissa. And I'm not a huge fan of this hashtag, as I've said before. However, at Quirky Pup tweeted, I like this one, be the person your dog thinks you are. Oh. Uh -oh. Yeah, I don't know um, if that's the best look. Tom, unbutton that. That's not cute, because Ralphie's already <laughs> shaking his head. And Ralphie is the king of fashion. So the Steelers have such a loyal <laughs> fan base. They always show up on the index somewhere. But Best fans in the NFL, would you say they are, Ralphie? Uh, they definitely travel very, very well, and certainly they're passionate uh, also and uh, very impressed by Jordan's. Uh, again, we talked about it earlier with Ohio State. Uh, these guys, unbelievable. Third-string quarterback leading this team to victory. Also want to point out, too, real quick, Cam Hayward, uh, who plays for the Steelers and once again wore eye black in tribute to his father. And the NFL, being as ridiculous as they are, are going to fine him once again for paying tribute to his father that, that passed away from cancer. This week, he's getting fined over $11,000 just for eye black that had uh, a tribute to his father in it and of course that uh, now brings his two game total to over $16,000 he's been fined by the NFL ridiculous